I guess continuing in the topic of love, I'm really happy um, that I started a topic because I've been in uh, almost like a, I've been eating some blueberries that I found <laughs> um, out there, a blueberry bush. I remember when I was little, oh my God, I used to just look for blueberry, I mean blackberries and just pick them out and it just reminds me when I was a little girl. Um, it brings back memories and it's a good feeling. And um, uh, I, I know I spoke about this in my, my dance community, um, but I was dancing and it felt like I was in the nothing and in the everything. I was in almost like the void. And I'm like, oh fuck, this feeling feels so familiar. And then um, I was like, when was the, the other time that this feeling was like super strong? And I remembered this, these feelings of, of like, etern like eternal, e like you're in, in this uh, energy of, of love, um, this, this, this magical place. I've been in it when I've been in love. So when I look further into that, was it that I really was in love with somebody? Or was it that I allowed my love to come out and engulf me to, to be that, that energy that, that made me feel like I could fly, like I could do anything, like I could go on the top of the mountains and preach to the world of how great love is? Was it the person? Or was it me allowing myself to engulf myself in the love I already contain? So, I think that the answer is me allowing myself. But how can I do that automatically and not feel a void of... of um, feeling like somebody needs to provide that for me. I think I already have it, but is it is it a um is it a habit? Is it constant? Is it a knowing inside of yourself? Um and that's where I'm working at. And that's where I'm moving towards and and I am also admitting the things that I did not allow myself to have that were connected to love because love was this thing that now I understand that it isn't. But I'm not fully, I haven't fully finished reading the whole definition of what it is. And um, I wanted to share this with you guys because I think that we move around and I'm not saying everyone, but we move around in this world with broken hearts and we don't want to love. But the thing is that about love is love is everything. So if we don't, if we don't allow ourselves to love um, what we think love is people, we also don't allow ourselves to love our creation because the people that come to us are our creation, our what we attracted to us based on what we believe is true. So um, when we um, block ourselves from love, we also block ourselves from abundance because abundance is the love of our creation. It's the love of, of the world that we have created. And um, like they say, abundance is doing what you want to do when you want to do it. But how can you do what you want to do when you want to do it when you despise the creation that you have already done today? So um, I'm move, moving, I'm going on a tangent right now, so let me stop there. And I just wanted to let you guys know that um, 
there's the, there's this 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 vast world of what love is and it's I am starting to recognize that it's something that I haven't experienced before um, and I feel like most of us haven't either um, and I just want to share with you guys so I hope you like this video like and subscribe and I will see you in my next video <laughs>